Swat 941, the base party station, Joey Franchise, Poppy Shampoo. Good to see my brother again, man. Back down here in Tampa. Man, hey, yo. Boogie with the hoodie. What's happening, player? Hey, yo, what's going on, man? You're ready, man. We man. Back, back in town. High Bridge is definitely in the building, man. This is crazy, bro. How's everything been since the last time I saw you, dog? Everything good, man. I'm just working harder, that's all. And let me congratulate you on the baby girl. Oh, good looking, man. I appreciate that. Oh, man. I love how it goes because your artist, she's Melody. Makes sense. Facts, facts. Perfect. <laughs> and she was born on the day of my first um, my first tape, Valentine's Day. Look at that. You can ask for a better situation than that. I swear. Yo, so um, last time we linked up, I mean, we, we vibed out. It was like your first time in Tampa, right? Yeah, we was in Tully vibing out. I was, I was cool right there, bro. <laughs> nah, good times, man. And since then, dog, like, I mean, you, you were playing me new music. Uh, I actually got to hear something off that Fast and Furious 8 soundtrack. And yeah. now the song is actually hit the blogs and is, is out there now. So yeah, how's facts. it feel to actually be a part of that? Man, I was just hype about that yesterday when I seen the picture. I was just... I was going crazy. Me and Buff was in the um, he was in the crib wilding. <laughs> nah, it's nuts. It's crazy. And then since then you had that, and then you had the Jordan brand ambassador dog. Yeah, yeah. Like how is that, man? Like man, I just got like three boxes with like twenty four <laughs> kicks. Yo, all that, man. whatever you don't want, son. Like I'm matter of fact, world, I need your size too. I got you. Facts. That, that's a good. He's a he's a real one. For oh, you got my word on that too. I got you already, bro. So like that's going down. What else can we expect more, man? Is a new tape on the way or? Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to just work with time though. Feel me? I don't want to just, just drop it though. Feel me? Like, I want everything to make sense. Exactly. And um, I saw that too. That um, uh, you and Kodak were you know working on some stuff before, uh, prior to him, you know, his situation. Um, what can we expect out of that? Is that is that something to expect on a new project? Yeah, me and um, me and Kodak got like three joints right now. Um, one of them is he's supposed to um drop his album, but I don't know what's going on right now. But you gonna hear you gonna hear one one of my tracks on his album, and then one on my album, and then you are gonna hear one on the Fast and Furious album. So for me, you gonna hear it on man. Yo, I'm I'm looking forward to that too. And you know, since you and him have that really good, you know, relationship together and working together, what is a side of Kodak that you got to see that probably a lot of people might not understand or have misunderstood about him? Like a lot of people question his filmy character, like, but they gotta understand where you're from, for me. And being around being around Kodak, even though we're not from the same exact place, we we all in a kind of way. So for me, I understand that because. Me and my bro, me and my bros, for me, like we, the way we, the way we move is, is a certain way. Everybody got a certain way of moving. Bro, you just gotta understand that. No, I respect that. And um, also with like, I know DJ Khaled is working on his next album. Is there a possibility that you gonna, you gonna make an appearance on that joint? Um, DJ Khaled. Um, has he, has he, has he rang the line yet? Nah, he ain't hit me for that. He ain't hit Are me you for look? The would album you, yet. would you be looking forward to doing something with him down the yeah, road? Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Facts. That's cool. I, I know. Mean, I know the time is gonna come. Time oh yeah, for everything. And I saw that too on your tours. Like uh, you got an exclusive, you know, situation with Title. Tell me more about that. What's going on with that? Yeah, um, me and me and Title working together right now on a lot of um, they they um sponsoring our tour, the TBA tour. That's one thing they're doing. Now, um, and we got something coming in the future too. So and blogs. and it goes back to what you were saying. Like you want to work with Hove. Yeah, and facts. This is like that one step closer, unless there's something that we don't know about. It already in the works, <laughs> <laughs> right? <Word. laughs> so, and uh, I want to talk to you, man. High Bridge is definitely making moves. I mean, you're doing your thing and, and touring around. Uh, I see Don Q's got his project out as well. Uh, what can you say about that, man? man like, Don Q, take he's killing man, it. That amazed me, man, for real, man. I'm proud of Don Q right now. It's, it's drop like he he did like 250 k in one day, and his other tape he passed that in one day. Like the first tape he did, um. What was the name of the first Save Dawn season? And then and then Corner Stories passed that in one day. You feel me? That was crazy. Can we expect a collab project from y'all? Yeah, we working on that right now. Yeah. <laughs> me, um, me, me and Dawn got something with um DJ Mustard coming soon. Well, we working on an album. That's dope. And uh also too, how's that Metro Boomin situation? Like, we, we all <laughs> working. Respect. We working with all of them though. Yeah, for you? real. Like they I told me doubt Metro that. Boomin, everybody, you got you got heat. Hits from everybody. And uh, I want to ask you, too, is, you know, being from the Bronx, like, I mean, this whole, re we're, we're all spectators at this point. Um, how you feel about this Remy Ma, Nicki Minaj stuff and, and the beef behind that? Like, what's kind of your take on that as a fan of, of music? Um, I'm I'm entertained, for me. Like, it's a sport to me. Word. I like when things like that are going on now in the music game. 
It just it keeps everybody like yeah, it like keeps the fire under you know that fire going. You, know, right? you, you hear the radio station come on, Nicki Minaj, this is um Remy Ma, this that's fire right there. <laughs> and it's crazy because we haven't seen that from females probably since Bro, like since what like, Foxy and Kim. Yeah, like little Kim and them like that's crazy, right? It's that's nuts. why it's hype. That's why it's so much hype right now. That's crazy. And you and you look at it as a sport too, right? Yeah, facts. So and it's it's only right. So we got a boogie in here, man. Swat ninety four one, the base party station with Joey Franchise here, man. Well, you out here it's in Tampa, man. Is. So it's finna get crazy this weekend. And well, uh, yo, see. definitely look forward to the next project, bro. And appreciate you stopping through, dog. Well, no, most definitely, bro. Already, man. A boogie, Joey Franchise, Swat ninety four one.